Well, that's something. Anyway. Oh god, the game. sure whatever you're saying is great. Oh, god damn it. quality on that is so good. I'm amazed how good that looks. Oh god, he keeps disappearing. Oh, that's weird. The game's glitching out. Look, the you can't see the life thing up there. Oh, that's weird. I knew I didn't have it plugged in all the way. really loud over the stream. the screen any better. That's kind of the best quality I can get. actually changed anything. Oops. Look, stuff keeps like randomly flashing on the screen. Oh god, what is that? No, stop that, Sonic. What 
Wait, what are the rings? Those aren't rings. They're just tails. We're watching it through my viewfinder because I'm at home. I don't have any stuff. I have a Sega Genesis and the webcam on my surface, and that's it. And you're just gonna have to deal with that. It's Christmas. Goodwill to all and all that. This is honestly how streams probably should be. They're endearing this way. More human than a billion dollars in webcam, microphone, whatever. Oh, goddammit. How's the game translation going? Um, alright. I'm like, I think 60% of the way through one of the characters. I hate these spinning things, I always mess them up. Um, I haven't had a chance to work on it that much recently. I've been putting in like 12 plus hour days at work to get my data before Christmas. So... I have to write the author a letter, like, hey, I'm going to translate your games, that alright? But, uh, oh god, why does Tails keep moving around the field? Can you see that in the camera? No, this is, uh, a direct feed from my own eyeballs. I'm going low f oh no! Oh god, what? No! I, I can't, no. Oh, oh wait, you can still see the orbs. Uh, uh oh. Oh, oh, we're still good. Oh, oh no. Oh, that's even worse. Uh. Okay, now I can't see the orbs anymore. Yeah. Oh, that's not good. Oh, there they are. <laughs> and the regular special stage screen just comes on. Like, hey, you know, whatever. <laughs> oh, wait, everything's just fine now. Ignore all of that. Don't, don't worry. That's, that's how it's supposed to be. That had expert comedic timing. I gotta say. Actually, a lot of the glitches it had before, where like the rings wouldn't render and the HUD was broken, all seemed to be fixed. weird. It's like it had to barf, and then it barfed, and now it's better. Ouch. Oh no, my screen's turning off. There we go. Your eyeballs need fixing. How's that sound? Yeah, I've got three locked on. I'd move the webcam, but setting it back up's a pain. And that's probably why it's glitching a bunch, because uh, when you have Sonic and 
or Sonic and Knuckles and Sonic 3 together, that's like twice the cartridges that need to be blown into to work. God, this is all my old capture stuff. My old $20 USB microphone that I used until I bought a Yeti. I should just do a bunch of really crappy streams like this. The internet is getting too polished about stuff. I don't like it. Like all the layouts and pop-ups and stuff are all too nice. The cameras are too nice. Oh, the screen's going to hell again. I don't think any stream I ever did actually looked this bad. Yeah, well, your eyes are going to bleed. I'm sorry. That's just how life works. Life makes all of our eyes bleed. Metaphorically, of course. It's like a lo-fi indie album, except with a webcam and Sonic. Oh no, that's not good. Ah, oh, my poor Genesis. Ouch. <laughs> just take damage on everything. That's how you play Sonic, you just get hit by everything. Tails, you're breaking the screen. Whoops. <laughs> oh, I'm terrible at everything. There we go. Well, the power supply in my Genesis was broken. I had to take it apart and resolder some stuff on it that had cracked. Um, so it might be the power supply. I also have a Nomad, I guess. Ooh. Uh, I could plug that into the TV. Oh, Tails, what? I think there's something that was supposed to have loaded in there and it didn't. Christmas and all that. Happy holidays. All the special stages are going to be broken again. Oh yeah, that's no, already kind of not looking very good. Oh. Wait, that doesn't say Sega. Uh. Sega. Oh. Uh. <laughs> That's pretty good. Oh, oh. I'm not, I'm not doing anything. Look, both my hands are here. See, there's... Oh.
Oh, it's actually a very nice shade of green, but you can't tell on the camera. I think my Genesis broke. You're trying. You're really trying. And I appreciate it. Oh! Oh. You'll get it someday. I tried to tweet a video of that. I don't know if my thing actually does video. My Twitter client. Oh. No. Oh. Oh. It's still going. <laughs> it keeps like kind of doing some of the intro and then it just can't <laughs> hey, oh. I wonder if I can, like, skip the intro and get to the game. No. <laughs> I can skip it. Oh. Well. I bet if you don't even touch anything, it'll eventually, like, reset itself. Seg. Oh. Uh-oh. Oh, no. It's not coming back. I don't want to blow in the cartridge. I want it to work. Let's cut the power. There we go. Yeah. Oh, no. No, that's that's worse. It used to like be vaguely in the shape of the Sega logo, and now it's just kind of like... A mess. <laughs> ah. 
Oh no. That actually looks kind of cool. I like how this is the part it got stuck on. If it were to get stuck on any part, this is the only part to be stuck on. Sega. I tweeted a video of it because I want to be internet famous. I want it to go viral. Come on. That's not Sonic. I mean, it's blue, but it's not Sonic. Man. My dream is dead. It's always the end knuckles part that doesn't work. <sighs> because I bought this cartridge used. And Sonic 3 I bought new. Oh, that's not good. Oh, come on. Okay, don't work. See if I can... did it. I bet it deleted all my data. Oh, it didn't. That's nice of it. Genesis does what Nintendo do the math. I don't even want to play this though. What I really want to play is Blue Sphere. Yeah. Uh. -huh. No way. No, really, like, no way, dude. What are you, what are you thinking? I'm gonna slaughter this game. I'm much better at this now than I was growing up, which I guess you would hope to be the case. You know that people generally get better at things as they get older. One would assume. Not always. Some people get worse. I've gotten worse at a lot of things in my life. Whoops, I didn't want that. Oh god, that's really bad now. <sighs> boop doop bop What are we gonna do about this?
gotten worse at finding reasons to live. It's Christmas. You could have an existential crisis tomorrow, not on Christmas. Actually, judging by statistics, you're probably more likely to have it over the holidays. When it's like, oh no, everyone's happy on Christmas but me, and now I feel sad about it. This may or may not have turned into a personal story. So I need that, I need a yellow, and then I need a blue, and then I need a red. In that order, oops. There we go. And then I need one more blue. Oh, damn it. Oh, damn it. No, 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 oh. Can I save this? No, I can't. Got it. It's weird being home. It's like life. I don't know, like you live on your own, you're in a different environment for so long, and you have like different views of how things are and how you yourself are, and then you go home and it's like it's all being recalibrated. It's hard to explain. It's like all these things that you thought you might have left behind about all that are all like right back here. It's like, oh yeah, that's right. Stuff is like this. People are like this. All that. Eat it. Take that arms. Boo well, it's hard to explain, and for me it's something different that probably doesn't apply to most of you. But, uh... Yeah, I don't know. Just like a reminder of a whole bunch of things. Uh, I need a purple. That'd be nice. Oh, God. Alright, I guess just pop it here then. It's not done. This isn't even the part that I had to hit, but... It was either that or lose. Uh, I don't know if I can... Well, I'll try to click it. What is it? Oh. Come on, everybody! We're late! Oh, is that just like Vaporwave, but with the Simpsons on it? No, like, this isn't... Like, after, I was in London studying abroad, and my parents said, like, oh, hey, Tim, we sold the house. So, like, where I am now is not where I grew up. Um, it's hard to explain exactly what I mean without telling you. Which I guess is most things. But I'm not really 
at that point yet. Oh no. I need a purple. Yo, hey, hey, I said I need a purple. Oh, I got one. Oh, I messed that combo up anyway. Yippee. Is it good or a bad thing? Uh... It's neutral? It's not really inherently anything. It's nice being home, if only for the fact that I don't have to work like 14 hours in the lab running brain slice electrophysiology, which I hate. Like, my god, it is so tedious and difficult, and it takes so long. Like, man. If the windows open in my lab, I might have considered jumping. But they don't. That's how they get you. I don't know. Doesn't really matter. Yeah, the the waveform data that you might have seen before, that's what I do. So you get a mouse, you kill it, you take the brain out, you dissect the hippocampus out, and then you slice it into 400 uh, micrometer slices. Now you have to do all of that in about 10 minutes. It's not hard to do. Like, the dissections are easy after you do them a few times. Um, but it's getting the electrodes in place, which is really hard. Because there are multiple pathways in the hippocampus. And you have to... Uh, get the electrode in the right one, and there's not really a very obvious way to know if you're there or not without washing in a drug, but if you wash in the drug, you can't wash the drug out, which means you can't use that for data. Um, you can only use it to know if you're in the right area, but you don't actually get any information from it. And it's really tricky, and you have to keep the slice alive in the chamber when you're poking electrodes at it, and the slice wants to die because it's not in a brain, and the fluid level is constantly changing because the tubing gets gummed up. Um, so, yeah, it's pretty tricky. But yeah, the other thing, um, I don't know. 
it's always a thing of like, yeah, I want to talk about this. And then always a thing of like, no, no, I can't ever. <laughs> Sounds like I killed somebody. I wish that'd be a lot cooler. Hmm. No. Oh, that's not where that needs to go. The next time I lose, I'm probably going to go and sleep or something. It's getting to be that time. I tried to sleep earlier. I didn't get very far. Like an hour. Maybe. I was working really late and my sleep schedule got all screwed up and I wasn't going to bed until like 7 in the morning and it's just been like that. These are all terrible combos. Oh, well. Yeah, I've tried melatonin. I've been taking too much and it doesn't really work anymore. It's hard to explain, Erewhon. I think problems are like that in general. No, wait, I wasn't done with that. No. Well, it's easy to word stuff. I don't know. You get to the point where it's also like, you know, people only have so much, I don't know how to put it, goodwill or patience to listen to you mope. I don't really feel like 
burning all that. Where it's just like, oh, every stream's gonna turn into a pity party. Wahoo. Pity parties also don't help, which is the problem. That's one thing I've learned about depression. It's like, no matter how much you really want to talk about it, it might feel okay in the short term. But then it's just like, oh, I keep bringing stuff up because I hope someone can fix it somehow, and they can't. And that's frustrating. Because it's like a lot of problems don't actually have solutions until you do something about them, and just deliberating on it forever is, uh... It doesn't count as doing. That was pretty much the new outlook uh, that I'd mentioned on Twitter. It wasn't like I joined a cult or anything. It's more just like... Um... I don't know how to put it, like, just do stuff about things, don't wallow if you can avoid it. Because the thing is, like, um, when I was, and to some extent still am, uh, seeing somebody regarding depression, a lot of the advice never, like, seemed super useful. In a way, it was a lot of, like, uh... It reinforced this idea that there's something, like, broken about you, in a way. Where it's like, okay, well, you need to realize that this is like this, and you have to do things differently and work with whatever limitations or in the confines of whatever you've got going on, and I don't know, that, that never sat right. And I'm sure, like, for some people, you can recontextualize a lot of thoughts and whatnot, which totally helps, but for me, it felt like it was taking a lot of, like, agency out of everything. So, the thought was like, alright, look, let's think about this in a new way, instead of uh, having this, um, sorry, I'm trying to find the right piece, instead of having this foregone conclusion that it's like, oh, I can't do X, Y, and Z because I'm sad. So, let's be productive and try to do things and be less sad about stuff. I can explain it better after I've had more than like an hour of sleep. But uh, then like a, a day or two later I started the uh, translation of Hat World just as like a thing to do. And that was fun. I mean, I'm like nowhere near done with it, but it is a fun thing to do. And I feel better doing that than I do uh, through many of the other quote-unquote strategies that they teach you in therapy. Again, for me, anyway, all these are uh, very variable things, depending on people, who you see, all that good stuff. Ah, uh, can you just die already, Spike? I can't look at the chat. There we go. Uh, yeah, the brightness, it's, it's hard because 
A, it's a TV, and B, it's late at night. Ouch. But yeah, I'm not uh, super eloquent at the moment. So, can try to do a better job at explaining things some other day. These are not good combos at all. Jeez. Oh, come on. Get out of here. Stop. No. Oh, come on. I'm gonna lose. <laughs> well, like, I love that screen, by the way, and the music. I'm really pissed off Robotnik. I guess it kind of like falls into this learned helplessness sort of thing where you just get into the habit of uh, feeling like everything is garbage and will be garbage forever and there's nothing you can do about it. And maybe it is, and maybe I'm deluding myself into thinking otherwise, but like... You kind of get stuck in that mindset and then it's hard to come out because it feels so real. <sighs> Stop that. Uh, I need a yellow. Is who Tim? Is what? I, I know nobody by that name. I guess for people who haven't seen this before, or aren't like, uh, haven't been around for a while, having like really awful video quality in this old microphone could totally be a different person. sleep thing, or try to anyway. Good night, have a good Christmas and all that good stuff.